Hey there, folks, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we've got a thrilling review to dive into. If you're a fan of Denzel Washington and his iconic roles, you're in for a treat. We're talking about The Equalizer 3, the latest installment in this action-packed franchise. Now, I know many of you have been eagerly waiting for this one, so let's not waste any more time and jump right into it. Alright, let's kick things off by talking about the man himself, Denzel Washington. I mean, who else could bring the character of Robert McCall to life like he does? It's like slipping into a comfortable pair of shoes. Denzel's charisma and on-screen presence are as strong as ever. In The Equalizer 3, he's back in action and it's hard not to root for this character. You'll find yourself cheering as he takes on the bad guys with that signature swagger and charisma. Plus, this time around, he gets to show a different side of McCall, speaking Italian and even mentoring a young CIA operative. Now, let's talk about the setting and storyline. This time, McCall finds himself in a picturesque part of Italy. It's not just about the action, it's also about the beautiful backdrop that adds to the charm of the film. McCall's journey in this installment revolves around protecting the local community from the Mafia, who have a tight grip on these lovely people. It's a familiar but effective plot that keeps you engaged from start to finish. Alright, let's address the elephant in the room, the action and violence. The Equalizer 3 is not for the faint of heart. There's violence aplenty, and some of it is downright brutal. But here's the thing, it's all draped in a veil of good intentions that make it easier to accept. Antoine Fuqua, the director, orchestrates the action with a propulsive style that keeps you on the edge of your seat. And trust me, there's a well-staged Spartacus moment that'll have you cheering as the bad guys get what's coming to them. One of the standout aspects of this film is the chemistry between Denzel Washington and Dakota Fanning, who plays a young CIA operative. Their scenes together have a familial undertone that adds depth to the story. It's not just about the action, it's about the relationships that McCall forms along the way. Fanning's presence brings out Washington's humorous side, making their interactions a welcome respite from the intense action elsewhere. And there you have it, folks, my take on The Equalizer 3. It's a thrilling ride with Denzel Washington at the helm, delivering exactly what we expect from this franchise, action, charisma, and a dash of heart. If you're a fan of the series, you won't be disappointed. So, if you enjoyed this review, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more exciting reviews and updates. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you in the next video.